we're simulating a crash scenario and they have to do an overnight 24-hour survival and uh, so the students have been instructed they've had uh, close to about 10 hours worth of classroom time and lab time and stuff like that where we taught them how to light fire how to bring tinder how to build a survival kit and everything they have has to fit inside a coffee can and that becomes a safety kit a survival kit that they have hopefully for the rest of their lives they always think about that and so in this industry you can find yourself working alone and in very remote places and if something is to go wrong i would like to know that my students have been at least instructed on how to survive at least 24 hours in the bush we uh we're allowed an axe here and a uh, few other things. And uh, we're just coming out here and survive for 24 hours. And we're not allowed any food items or anything. We're allowed water, but we have to make our water from the snow. So we got our fire there and we could put this on to warm up our water. We boil it for like a minute so that it's disease free. So we have our uh, nice lean to here, um, pretty sturdy. <laughs> we got lots of spruce brows to keep the heat in. Uh, he also gives us a, a tarp as well. So we laid that on top in case it rains. We have a sit log so that we could sit on there, have the fire, or we can sleep or nap or whatever you'd like. Well, <laughs> if anything were to happen, like you're out in the bush with a quad and your quad breaks down or the battery dies, you are be able to survive overnight until somebody comes to help you. Uh, it's really fun. We have lots of uh, hands-on stuff to do. We, uh, we're always outside and doing something really fun and outdoorsies as in uh, <laughs> uh, sampling and stuff like that. And it's just a really fun program. We have great instructors. What we have here is, is a signal fire. Um, and so it's, they've, they've prepared it so that when an airplane comes over that they have a chance of lighting it. Intent is the smoke will rise above the canopy and the airplanes flying over it will uh, we'll see that smoke and come to your rescue. I love the outdoors I guess and it's super fun just being out here and being able to start fires and just stay the night outside.